this is Robin. Um, I want to welcome all of my new friends and the ones been with me from the beginning. Um, sorry for the way I look. I've been, my eyes are swollen, just a lot going on. I just wanted to give an update on my mom. Um, I talked to her last night and I talked to her this morning. They're not sending her home today. They're actually sending her for a echocardiogram of her heart. I know they did um, blood work and um, urine. They did a CAT scan, EKGs. Uh, they're doing all kind of tests uh, to try to find out, you know, whether it's um, anxiety slash panic attacks that she's taken, or is it really something to do with her heart? So, um, if you would still continue to keep her in your thoughts and prayers, I'd greatly appreciate it. Um, I am really sorry for posting that video last night where I was really upset, but, um, you know, one day you talk to a family member and they're fine. And then the next day you call and you find out they're in the hospital. Um, you never know what's going to happen from day to day. So if nothing else, um, keep in touch with your family members and you know whether it be brothers sisters moms dads children grandchildren let them know that you love them and that you care about them and that you're there for them no matter what and um i i know some of you may not understand why i'm not going in uh the three hour drive to where my mom is to at the hospital I've got two sisters and two brothers and a niece uh, that are back there. Um, I had a few things happen down here with my checking account. Um, someone got my number from my debit card and took money out of our account, so I need to go take care of that today. Um, uh, my mom, I'm talking to her, she's talking, she's very tired, but she is feeling somewhat better since they gave her that shot. Um, at a van, I think they said it was, or something like that. But anyway, it brought her heart rate back up. Um, she was breathing better. She said it felt like she was choking, like she couldn't breathe. And um, her chest was pounding real bad, and she was lightheaded and dizzy. And um, that's why she went to the hospital, because she couldn't breathe. So anyway, I just wanted to do an update. And my mother has always worried about us kids always um more than herself and she always has known how upset i get i take panic attacks anxiety attacks also i have my whole life i'm on medicine so i am somewhat better but um you know while i was talking to my brother he's like look you're already upset and this is what mom doesn't want she doesn't want you worried or upset and I tried to explain to him, she's my mother. I'm going to be worried and upset. And everybody handles their, you know, sadness or pain in different ways. So um, I asked her if she wanted me to come up. And I told her if she needs me, all she, she knows she just has to say the word. So um, anyway, thank you, Nzal, for your um, video responses uh, for my prayer for my mom. Um everybody that has left comments i will try to get back to each and every one of you i just wanted to do a little bit of an update on my mom and i will continue to keep you updated thank you again for everything from the bottom of my heart all your comments um your prayers your thoughts uh the ones tina that did a video response liz um sarah robinson um you know, I just can't believe all of the love that I found on YouTube through my YouTube family. And I don't want to start crying again because I have things I need to do today. So I'm just going to get off of here. And I love each and every one of you. And thank you again. And I will continue to keep Yins updated. All right. Thank you. Bye.